welcome back to my channel. Today is Sunday, March something, and Nick and I are on the way to Allegheny National Forest. And the reason why we're going up there is because Nick killed a bear this past fall. And so he is getting a, a rug and a European mount of his bear. So should be fun. We're gonna run around and enjoy the day. It's quite a nice day. So, yeah. <laughs> oh, wait, there's one other thing. So yesterday, if you watched yesterday's video or whatever, my, my last, if you watched my last video, um, you saw that I, well, we bought a scratch ticket, a scratch off ticket, scratch off. We bought a scratch off ticket as a indicator of how our day fishing was going to be. And I scratched it off and I lost. And then I had a, a fun day fishing, but a horrible day in terms of my catch. I didn't catch a thing. So I've got another scratch off ticket. And this is going to be my indication, my indicator for whether or not I find a shed today or Nick finds a shed today. And we got the donut doubler <laughs> because Nick and I eat donuts every Sunday. That's like our thing. We call it donut Sunday. I would eat a donut any day, but it's just like our little tradition. So I'm gonna scratch this thing off and find me a shed. <laughs> okay, bye. <laughs> one left. It's not looking very good. I'm not going to find a shed today. No! <laughs> We've made it to the forest. I don't know why I feel like I have to whisper. It's probably because we're in the woods. And every time I'm in the woods, I want to see animals. Oh, baby, look. This, my friends, is a white pine tree. And we are in a spot of the forest where there are a lot of trees that have never been touched before. So according to the little sign on the trail, <laughs> that we walked past when we first got here. Um, you can tell just by the sheer size of the tree, but when we walked past, I first noticed from the bark, like how deep these ridges are within the bark. And then if you look up at how big this thing is. This is probably a 300 plus year old tree, which is really cool. It's a beautiful tree. And it makes me really happy <laughs> that I know that now. Um, and to see this, this is cool. look at the bark it looks very similar to the bark of the white pine that we were looking at but it's not a white pine and I can tell by the needles so this is a hemlock pine um, and I can tell by the needles so these aren't the needles of it but that's what the needles of a hemlock pine look like I don't even know how old this one is this one I can't tell as easily <laughs> as if I'm some tree expert <laughs> but it's cool <laughs> it's my baby. I need to move so I can be so we we don't have a GPS with us but we didn't want to just stay on the trail we wanted to see if we could find 
you know, some critters or just cool stuff in the woods. Um, not saying that you can't find or see that on a trail, but it's just funner to be off the trail. But we don't have a GPS with us, so we weren't going to, but we crossed this little stream and we were like, let's just follow the stream. So instead of hiking on the trail, we are either staying along the stream or somewhere where we can, you know, easily get back to the stream. So it's kind of like our own natural, you know, trail, if you will. So we'll be able to get back to the truck and we won't have to worry about getting lost. Let's take a look at this leaf I found. It's decomposing, obviously, but it looks like, like lace. It's really beautiful. Let's see if we can spot a brook trout. Now when you're sneaking up on a brook trout, you've got to be really quiet. Don't forget your camouflage. <laughs> we just saw a brook trout swimming in this little itsy bitsy stream. <laughs> They're super small, they're like this big and they spook very easily. We just walked past and you can just like see the ripple in the water from them swimming away. Um, but Nick just saw one and I couldn't really see it because of the reflection. Um, but he had something in his mouth, he was eaten. And now he's under this log, but I don't know if we can film him because the reflection of the water. But he's cute. Oh, the roots. This is cool. Oh wait, yeah. But We found a secret deer spot. There were lots of tracks, lots of um, piles of poo, <laughs> lots of <laughs> um, scrapes, rubs. And I marked my spot on my phone, which somehow, even though I don't have service, it was, it allowed me to like mark my longitude and latitude so we'll be able to find it again so <laughs> We just concluded our hike and just sat in the truck <laughs> and munched away for like a solid 10 minutes. Mm. Now I'm feeling better. And now we are going to show you guys Nick's bear. Let's see, he's laying it out right now. Check that fella out. Are you happy with how it came out? Very. Yeah. I like the face. I know, me too. He's big. I don't know how long he is. Maybe close to six feet. Yeah. He's a big boy. I'm guessing he was like three years old. Yeah. Maybe four. I don't know. We'll spy that one too. Yeah. I really don't know. He tasted good. So I can't imagine he's too old. He doesn't have any scars on his face or anything. Mm hmm. Probably hadn't been in too many fights. Who knows? Maybe he's two. I don't know. 238 seems pretty heavy though for 
Very young bear. Two year old, yeah. You want to explain to everybody uh, what shirt you're wearing? <laughs> I was making fun of you. I love it. Can't you tell how old, I mean, have an idea of how old they are by the space in between their ears? Like how far down the side of their head the ears are? Like if it was a younger bear, wouldn't it be like the ears would look more like here? Older bears, the ears seem to be further down the side of the head. I think that's a way for judging the age of a bear. Probably five feet wide. His wingspan. Hold me way more. Tell me love you. Well, <laughs> we did not find any sheds today. Um, we didn't really look that hard. We didn't look that hard, that is true. But we did find a very good potential deer spot for the upcoming season. And by upcoming, I mean like five months away. <laughs> this fall, six months away, I don't know, whatever. But we are headed home now. Today was a lot of fun. Um, so thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next video. <laughs>